So hello there guys and welcome back to the channel. This is Mel's Gaming here with another The Hunter Call of the Wild video. Now as you guys know I currently have early access to Revon Tuli Coast and the update that comes with Revon Tuli Coast and you guys wanted to know one thing which is is there any new multi mounts? Well yes there is and we're going to take a look at all of them. The first is this one which is Foul Play which you need a male raccoon dog and a male willow ptarmigan for. It's actually quite a cool mount i couldn't actually work out what was going on at first but it is like the ptarmigan pulling on the raccoon dog's tail which is really cool but when you see it in the mount for the first time it just because of the fluffiness of the tail and the fluffy feet on the ptarmigan you, you kind of can't see what's going on but yeah it's like pulling on the raccoon dog's tail which is cool the next one is Bear Necessities, which is two male black bear, which I wasn't expecting this as a multi-mount with this update because obviously there's no black bear on Revon Tuli Coast, but a really cool multi-mount and one I think that we really needed in-game, one for the black bear. The next one is Foul Feud, which is two male black grouse. Really, really cool multi-mount with some really cool poses. And we are going to go through and look at all of the, the mounts and all of their poses in a second. I have set them all up in this room here in Spring Creek Manor. So we'll go and take a look at them and go through all of the poses. But the, the black grouse one is really, really cool. And yeah, I was really, really happy to actually see one for the two male black grouse. Now the next multi mount that we're going to take a look at is the final one, Smooth Operator, which is a male Western Capicale and two female Capicale, which it's just a really cool multi mount and you guys will know if you've been watching any of my videos about this map. The Capicale are perhaps one of my new favourite species, if not my overall favourite species now in the game. Just a really, really cool bird and I was really happy to see a multi mount for these guys. So four new multi mounts in total with this update all of them really cool i just particularly like this one which like i said i just like the capicale so i was really happy to see a multi mount for these guys and yeah so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna walk around this room in which i have all four of these multi mounts set up and you guys can see me go through all of the poses for each of these multi mounts so we're starting off with the smooth operator mount of the male capicale and the two females and like i said i really love this multi mount the male capicale in real life have such attitude and i think they've done such a fantastic job of capturing that in game and capturing it with this multi mount it's just so full of attitude and i absolutely love it a really really fabulous multi mount there now moving on to foul feud which is the two male black grouse this one actually has a ton of different poses and they're all really cool there's some really quite wild poses of these guys fighting and they're all quite realistic so i was really really keen on this multi mount and i'll try and give you guys some different angles of it but yeah i think this could look really awesome with a couple of diamonds or a couple of rares but it's just some really cool poses like that one is so cool I think they've done a really, really good job on this particular multi mount, and I feel like this is just going to be a really fabulous display piece. Really, really cool. Like, yeah, some real, like, aggressive poses. But, like I said, quite a few different ones in there. And, yeah, I quite like this one as well. I think it's just really, really nice. Such a, like I said, just such a nice multi mount. It's the kind of multi mount I like is these kind of realistic ones where you either have a couple of males fighting or males displaying to females those are always my favorite multi mounts so really happy with that now moving on to the bare necessities multi mount which is actually really cool there's some very cool poses for this this is my favorite pose with them running like this but there's actually quite a few different ones with them stood up some with them stood up roaring um some with them sort of like playing and play fighting this one's really quite cool with them both stood up on their hind legs roaring that's quite a centerpiece mount i think this one it looks kind of goofy, but I can see, like, you know, maybe this being used in trophy lodges that like the goofier poses. Just a bit like the, the alligator with the raccoon riding on top of it in some of the uh, poses for the not a log multi mount. This one is also quite goofy of them sort of rolling around, almost sort of playing here, which it's it's quite cute to be fair. Not the kind of thing I go for in my trophy lodge. This is far more what I'd go for in my trophy lodge with them sort of fighting or play fighting here. I really like this. I think this is a very, very cool position for this mount. It's 
a little bit sort of off center on the uh, actual platform which is a shame i would like to move it backwards a little bit actually on the platform just so that it fills the platform a little bit better but again just some really cool poses this one's also really cool because again it's quite realistic of them just feeding then you've got the one sort of shouting at the other there which is quite cool and then back to them running which again looks quite realistic i really like that i think it just looks really nice and it's a good way to show off a couple of black bear which is really cool we needed a black bear multi mount so really really happy to see that and then we have this one which is foul play now we have a black white raccoon dog here and a white willow ptarmigan and i think these two look so good in a multi mount together if these were both diamonds i think this would be amazing and you can see here the ptarmigan pulling on the raccoon dog's tail when i first saw it like i said i wasn't quite sure what was meant to be going on here but yeah it is quite clearly pulling on the raccoon dog's tail which is quite funny but I much prefer the more realistic poses, as I've said. So the ones of the raccoon dog actually catching the ptarmigan here, I think are really, really cool and well done. Very, very lifelike. And of course, the one where it's chasing the ptarmigan like this is just really, really cool. Because again, that's what you'd see out in nature. But that is going to be it for this video, guys. Just a quick one going over the brand new multi mounts as you guys requested. And yeah, I'm really, really happy. I can't wait to try and get some diamonds and rares to make these multi mounts. Um, these are all just quick trophies I grabbed off the map. They're all just like golds or interesting fur types that I grabbed, other than the couple of black bear, which I already had a couple of diamonds for. But the other mounts, I just quickly went out onto the map and shot one of each for the uh, for the species just so that I could display it for you guys in the trophy lodge here. So yeah, I hope that was useful. And yeah, let me know down in the comments what you guys think of the new multi mounts. Which is your favourite? Which is the one that you're most looking forward to putting together? And yeah, what do you think of them overall? I like all of them. Like I said, there's a couple of goofy poses in the black bear one. But like I said, if you're going for something a little bit like more light-hearted then it could fit really well. Like, if it was in the same room as uh, the Not-A-Log multi-mount with the raccoon riding on the alligator, I suppose it could look really cool as just, like, a, a more light-hearted centerpiece. But, yeah, that's going to be it for this video, guys. Thank you so, so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you.